I said, you're going to be able to work on your beach and you're going to have, be able to get data everywhere. Like, wireless. I mean, he, he, said, he said the word wireless, and none of us even knew. And I remember the GM guy talking about it, what's all good about standards. It's corporate compliant desktops. That's going to be the way that all the data interchange is going to happen. I think it's bullshit that standards will make a difference, to be blind. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm a guy that is passionate, so you know you guys can jump on me as well. <coughs> but, you know the problem with standards and Agile started with PDX, the data standard, and there was you know PIPs, 2C1 through 2C6. So there was supply chain standards that are there. Really, the only ones that have persisted in the supply chain are EDI standards on on advanced ship notices, those kinds of things. Data standards, I think, will hurt you and will hurt us because if you do that, it will crimp the innovation, because we want you to be flexible, and when we come up with something that's amazing, whether it's new cloud models of doing CAD and the 3D modeling in the cloud, if there was a data standard that prohibited him from doing some amazing things, it would hurt you. And the problem too, I've been on standards bodies, it takes years to get people to agree. I was on a SCSI disk drive standards body, it took us three years to figure out how many pins and what were the pin assignments on a connector. So I think, it's, I think it, it hurts you from a standards perspective. It hurts us as vendors to help you continuously innovate. So I think there's going to be...